Greetings and welcome to the Astronomy Picture of the Day podcast. Today's picture for October 9th of 2024 is titled M106, a spiral galaxy with a strange center. So what do we see here? Well, here we see as detected a spiral galaxy known as M106. So that is one of those of the Charles Messier catalog back from the 1700s, where we looked for objects which were not stars, but were a little bit fuzzy and could have been confused with comets. So here in a much more modern picture with much more detail, we can see the distinct spiral arms coming out from the center of the galaxy with the blue color of those spiral arms signifying many blue star clusters, very young star clusters that signify recent star formation. We can also in those spiral arms see the distinct pink glow of hydrogen gas also associated with star formation. But what is quite interesting about M106 is that it's not an ordinary spiral galaxy. It's one of what we call an active galaxy. And those are galaxies that are emitting different types of energy. They give off things like radio waves and x-rays in excessive amounts compared to an ordinary galaxy. So yes, the center of our galaxy gives off some some radio waves and some x-rays. But by comparison to the ordinary light, it's very little. However, galaxies like these active galaxies give off more energy. They're brighter overall, and they give off different types of energy. They also often have jets of material. And in fact, there are jets of material going the length of this galaxy uh, that are being expelled out from the black hole at the center. So this is an example of what we call a Seifert galaxy. Seifert galaxies are an active class of spiral galaxies. So they are spiral galaxies with an unusually energetic and bright core. And you can even get an idea of that looking at this galaxy. This core looks a little unusual. You have a lot of excess hydrogen gas there. You can see all of that pink glow there. Whereas usually it's much more uniform with the spiral arms just spiraling down into the center. So it's an unusually active one, which can be caused by different things. But overall, the activity is caused by the black hole at the center. As material feeds into the black hole, it can become more energetic and give off many of things like x-rays and radio waves that can be part of an active galaxy. So that black hole is really the overall cause of what is happening with uh, the galaxies much like this. And in many ways, Seifert galaxies are important because they're relatively nearby, making them easy to study. And they have some similarities, although on a much smaller scale, to the very distant active galaxies that we know as quasars. And it is possible that the Seifert galaxies are then quasars, but on a much smaller scale, not as energetic as they were in the early history in the of the universe. But we can still get maybe some better ideas of what might be going on by studying these more local phenomena that have similarities to the very distant ones that we often study. So that was our picture of the day for October 9th of 2024. It was titled M106, A Spiral Galaxy with a Strange Center. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture. So until then, have a great day, everyone, and I will see you in class.